We want to thank you for being here this morning for our 30th annual Mayor's Prayer Breakfast. This tradition started back in 1992 as a Mayor's Breakfast with about 60 plus in attendance and has grown over the years to over 300 of the county's political, professional, business, and spiritual leaders. We come together on this day to recognize the importance of faith and prayer and the positive influence it has in our lives and our role as leaders in our communities. I've been coming to this breakfast since the very beginning. I love coming to this event every year. It brings people from all different parts of our community. This is certainly a wonderful time of the year. It's a great way to start the holiday season. And I came because I think we needed a prayer breakfast, especially this year. Great camaraderie and uh, great organization. We love the speakers, it's very inspirational, very spiritual, and we'd love them to do more events like this throughout the year. I think it's uh, something we should be doing on a very regular basis. It's just been uh, great for the community as a whole, and uh, I think God really just uh, blesses the event altogether. So. We'd like to introduce our speaker for today. Mr. Diaz is a senior partner at Dilworth Paxson LLP, where he concentrated his practice on litigation, dispute resolution, government relations, energy, and public housing development. When I left here 30 years ago, was involved with the Billy Graham Crusade, and I was fortunate to be chair of it, only because there were 10 African American pastors and about seven to eight white pastors, and they couldn't agree on whether it should be white or black, so they decided Nelson Diaz is neither, so let's pick him. <laughs> so I had absolutely no qualification to be chair. I was a judge, I was not a minister, but I tell you, it was a glorious time in my life. There's a lot I don't know. There's a lot I have no idea where I'm going. There's a lot of times when I hit a wall, somebody fires me. I take another turn to the right and somehow make that turn and a door opens. Why? Because he has something for you that you have no idea. You have no idea it's going to be for you and it's going to open up opportunities for you, your family, and a community. 
I became an agent of change, not only for my community, but for many others so that God's Word can be active. I don't have to talk it, you just have to do it. And if you do it, that is your example. So I hope that you enjoy my book, and I hope you enjoy the stories. God bless you. sharing meaning, which is so important, I think, in these days, right, to be able to get together with your neighbors and the folks that are doing great work. And on behalf of all the mayors, I thank you all this morning for attending. This is what it's all about, so thank you to the committee that continues to put this together and to all of you for coming. Great, great job. This is, this is what it's all about. Thank you.